Right, so the way that we write um, sums in algebra is actually quite different to how we write it in normal arithmetic. So for addition, the way we write is actually still quite similar. So normally you might have something like this. So if you were to think of two plus a, well, in algebra, you would still write it as two plus a. We keep the plus sign or the addition sign. For subtraction, it's the same. So say you had three minus b, you would still write it with the minus sign. Okay, this stays in the um, expression. Now, this is where things get a little bit different. If you had four times c, in algebra, you write multiplication as touching each other like this. So four times C becomes four C. And the last one is division. So say you had something like five divided by D. Well, that would actually become five over D. Now, a really good way to remember this is that um, division actually looks like a fraction. It's something over something else. So it's a good way to remember that this gets written as a um, fraction. So multiplication and division, we don't write the symbols for those, but um, subtraction and addition, we do. So for this first one here, eight, divided, uh, eight minus E divided by four, these get combined together. Um, because we keep the negative sign and E gets written over four. So four times F minus E, these get combined together. So we get four F minus E. For this one, the division gets combined together. Well, we don't combine the um, addition. So it becomes negative three over G plus 17. So in this example, you actually have to combine two different ones. You can see that we've got a multiplication and a division. So this would become negative two divided by I plus three J. This example, again, we've got a multiplication and we've got a division, except this one will become negative four K plus two over L. And in this last one, you can see we've got a division here and we've got a multiplication here. So it becomes 10 plus S divided by seven minus four T. So you can see that using this method, it just makes the equation, uh, the expression, sorry, a lot more simplified, more condensed and easier to read. So that's why it's really important that we know how to write our operations properly in algebra.